Brown Town Farms was founded in 1908. It was purchased by my great-great-grandfather, Sandy Brown and Collins Jackson. The 348 acres was purchased for $1,200 and the taxes was 50 cents. Uh, we grew tobacco for the majority of the years here on the farm. In the late 80s and early 90s, we got out of tobacco production. Uh, in 2006, we started to rehabilitate the land and switch over to more of a uh, vegetable operation. Farming is in our roots. Uh, our mission is simple. Um, this has been a family business since 1908. I graduated college. I majored in agriculture business, and I wanted to come back home to the farm to keep the family farm going. So uh, we do it for passion. We do it from our tradition. We do it because of history, and we do it because customers love locally grown produce. We love to give back to the community and, and just allow them to have an outlet to experience farm life through agritourism. Consider a career in agriculture because agriculturists are responsible for three things. That's food, clothing, and shelter. They are a necessity for life. Uh, Without agriculture, the world stops. So, you know, far as being secure and doing something that you love and being outside and just kind of being free and getting in tune with nature, I think agriculture is a great way to go as far as a career choice. In preparation for looking ahead at a career in agriculture, it's always good to partner with another farmer or go to outreach events hosted by Virginia State University or other land grant institutions um, in the state or other states. I would say, definitely just try to get some kind of educational component. Um, it doesn't have to be a four year degree, but now Virginia Tech has a two year agriculture program that a lot of students um, attend and come back to the farm and try to uh, take control of the farm and do it in a better way and, and, and kind of be innovative. I think these days we have to be innovative in farming. We have to kind of utilize the traditional methods, but take it a step further and, and have some innovation and have a way to allow farming to go to the next level. We have local customers. We have customers who are in Richmond. We sell to some CSAs, which is community supported agriculture. We do farmers markets occasionally. Uh, we sell retail here on the farm. We also sell to different food hubs. We sell produce and, and jams to uh, markets in the DC area and in, in Baltimore area. We do what we do because we love it. Uh, we love farming. It's, it's in our roots. It's, it's something that we've um, always done.